Good morning everybody, Belinda here. Welcome if you're new and welcome back. Um, this is a 14 by 14 inch canvas. So firstly, I'm going to lay down my white paint and I'll be back in a flash. Okay, so I'm just going to give that a torch. Hopefully it's not a flamethrower. Lots of bubbles because I've just mixed up my paints. Lots and lots and lots of bubbles. You can see them all just hanging out there in the center. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Flamethrower. It's a bit scary when that happens. But I should be used to it by now. Okay, so if I have a bit of time, I'll be able to tell you a little story. Maybe I'll start, I'll start my story. So I think um, some of you may know I have a really, really gorgeous cat. Some of you are not obviously cat people, but um, for those of you who are, I think you know that you know there can be it can be quite rewarding having a cat. And she is so beautiful, so intelligent, and she's got. She's just got so many great qualities. She was raised by a deaf family. And um, therefore, you know, she's a lot she's a lot more intelligent and observant than a lot of other cats. Anyway, long story short, she had a bath, her annual bath. <laughs> and my neighbour doesn't actually like her very much and that first well he doesn't really like anybody really and um, she decided after I had kept her in for a bit and towel dried her she decided that it was time for her <laughs> to go and sit on his bonnet of his car now ordinarily I actually don't tolerate that so I take one look at her and she's sitting on the car outside of his window and I'm like you're going to get into trouble, girl. And I'm like the cat whisperer. And I'm like, <laughs> get back here. Come here. Trying to be quiet, but trying to get her attention at the same time. Eventually, she did come in. And she's giving me a long talking to, because I gave her a talking to. And then he's on the... I can hear him on his phone in the house, in his house. He's talking very loudly. And... Um, <laughs> she's sitting by his ranch slider which is closed with her ear pressed up against the, the door and it was just so funny and I'm again come here kitty come anyway that's me <laughs> you probably think I'm a crazy cat lady okay let's blow this out is gorgeous I uh, that's a little flat that's not too bad Wow well, maybe I'll try I wonder if I should try and blow a little bit out that way or okay let me just check it out first I'll just give it a torch
to see what else I can get you. So if any of you guys have any <laughs> have had any strange occurrences with your pets, yeah, let me know, know in the comments field. They're so clever and what she was listening to, I don't know, but she was eavesdropping for sure. <laughs> it's so funny. And I was like, oh my word, he's going to catch it. Okay, so, um, although I like this very much, it just seems that there's quite a bit of paint over here. And I do love this. Um, so the colors I used was red, Prussian blue, and the 24K gold. Let's see if I can get anything to come up over here. Mm, looks so pretty. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh, I think I'm going to leave it like that, guys. I'm going to bring you in for a close-up. I know this is just a quick short one. But wow. It's so effective that um, I don't really want to do anything. Okay, now I'm going to use the scary one again. Gold is beautiful as usual. You know, it never disappoints me. I don't know if you guys have tried this gold, but pretty much I've been using it for most of a year, really. And um, honestly, it always gives great results. Okay, I just see something there I've got to grab. I hate when you see a little hair, you know, and or something. And you know there's a huge possibility of it messing up your composition. There's a lot of red here. I'd love for that some of that to come out. Oh yeah, look at that. So I do find that sometimes, you know, when you the longer you let it sit for you know, it gives a chance for the heavier colours, heavy bodied colours, colours to sink and the other colours will come through. I want to see some more of that red there. Wow. Okay. So that thing I think has got a safety something on it, so it does tend to just stop whenever it feels it needs to. Right, guys. Hmm. Do I blow some of this off? Um. No, I think I'll leave it like that. It's quite a lot of gold, hey. All right, I'll bring you in for a close-up. Okay guys, um, so this is it, uh, excuse the light reflection, can't be helped unfortunately, it's quite dark in here, looky looky, love that, and this I'm not sure if, if the camera is picking it up, but all those beautiful little red cells, that's what I was trying to get to pop up. Guys, if you're interested in any of my artwork and purchasing it, um, email me with babe at gmail.com. I absolutely adore this one. Very, very beautiful. Look at that, all that lacing. There are more cells popping up at the top there. Hopefully some of that red will come through at the top as well. I'm not sure if it will, but yeah, like I said, the longer it sits for, the more pop colours pop. So guys, thank you very much for watching once again, and I'll see you in the next one.
Bye.